Hey guys, MattBoy115 here again. And I've got another volume for the Sprite Comic Effects tutorials, but uh, this may be the last one because I'm running out of tricks to show. So, uh, let's get started here. I'm going to show you how I did these lasers on the front of Samus's ship and the explosion and this blast of light. So I'm going to open up GIMP and I didn't get any comments on the last episode about this splash screen. If anybody wants me to show a tutorial on how to make a splash screen, just tell me. Because you can make one with anything on it, your face, whatever, whatever suits you. If you don't like the picture that's on it already, then you can go ahead and put a new one on it. Okay, first the blast of light on the last panel. Kick a supernova. And make it big enough where it's uh, Well, first I think what you would want to do is make a selection. Fill the selection with whatever color. Normally you can do this drag thing and fill a selection that way, but for some reason w during recording it won't let me do that. I'm going to make a border. Okay. While keeping the selection there, go light and shadow, supernova, and put the supernova right at the top left, top, yeah, top left corner. Make it a little bit bigger, like this. You can put as many spokes as you want, however dense you want it. You can make it a random color, a bunch of random colors, or you can choose what color you want it to be. Like that. And there you have a really nice blast effect off in the distance or something. And then with the uh, with the lasers charging up that look like headlights, kind of, you would I'm going to take a, uh, a sprite of, sp of Simus's ship, copy and paste it into here, I'm take the color out of it, 
just because I can. And you would do the same effect as before, supernova, but only but only make it look make it small ones. Just like make another one over here and you've got supernovas on here to make a laser charging up. With the explosion I just put a bunch of little mini explosions from other sprites that I found. not really anything worth showing. But if you are able to find this sprite sheet right here, it has a lot of Eggman's different inventions and ways of stopping Sonic. In, in Sonic Advance and that's where I get a lot of my explosions if you could get some Mega Man explosions too I don't have any of those That's really all I have. Oh, deform text. If you want to make text that is deformed, but deformed in a way that emphasizes the text in some way, or just kind of shows that it's a sound effect, then you would you would make your text I'm going to make it yellow and red just like the other one why is it not yellow and red why is it not yellow I mean Oh. Okay. And I'm going to make it bigger. I'm going to go to the text layer. Go alpha to selection after right clicking. Go to select grow probably by 4. Yeah and make a new layer under the text layer I'm gonna go red make the layer under the text layer red oh yeah it's on color erase there now I'm gonna I'm gonna merge down the text layer onto the red layer so now it is just regular yellow and red text. Now I'm gonna go filters, distort, eye warp. And go over here and just mess with the text. Just like do stuff like this. But there's other stuff you can do with it too, like grow. And it makes it do that. It looks cool. There's swirl.
So that and there's a lot of stuff you can do to text to make it look cool. That's really all I have to show right now because I don't have that many tricks that I use. At least none that are interesting. So if you like this video then comment. I like comments. I love comments. If you have a video response that means to make one please do so. I'm MattPoy115 and I'm signing out.